Hello students, I am recording this video to demonstrate how to attach a document in a Moodle forum, whether the document is a Word file, a PDF, or um, any other attachment that you need to include in a Moodle um, forum. I know that um, some students get stuck at a certain point um, in, the pro in the process and do not know how to proceed. And so I'm going to share my screen with you, take you over to our Moodle course and demonstrate how to attach a file. So go ahead and share my screen. In just a moment. Okay, good. So then here we are on our modal course page for the composing process. And I'm scrolling down to week, week five, which is where the forum three is located. And I'm going to, here it is. So I'm gonna pretend that I'm one of you and I am about to um, upload my um, article in the um, forum for the articles. So you click open the folder in the forum, that is as per usual, and then you click on the button that allows you to add your, <clears throat> your post to the forum as per usual. And then it is at this juncture here where you have to do um, um, where most students kind of um, get stuck. And so let me sort that out for you. Um, as per usual, in the subject box, you type the subject. And in this case, um, it would be best if you just type the, the title of the, of the article that you are uploading. And so I have a sample article here saved on my desktop um, for demonstration purposes. And it's called um, Emancipation Day in Trinidad. And Tobago, something is wrong with the spelling. Let me fix it. Emancipation. E M A N C I P A T I O N. Why is that not taking? Um, oh, no N. My bad. Emancipation Day in Trinidad. Tobago. Okay, so, and then in the message box, um, you will um, include your main point summary here because that will accompany, you're required to type a main point summary of the contents of the article in the message box here to accompany the article that you're going to be uploading. Likewise, um, for those of you who will be uploading a video. So just as a space holder, I'm gonna just type, um, insert your key main point summary here, okay? Um, a very important tip um, is this. If you are, um, about to upload a file in a Moodle forum, um, but you are only required to upload the file and not really required to add anything in this message box. Um, that is not the case in this particular assignment, but just for future knowledge. Um, Moodle forums force us to put something in this message box. If you do not uh, place anything in this message box, it's not going to allow you to move forward. It's not going to allow you to, um, to save or post a forum and you will get stuck right here. This is probably one of the junctures at which some students get, um, get hindered. So um, if you're not required to put anything in the box here, what I usually advise is just to copy and paste um, the title that you have up there, I paste it here. And just so you can have something in this message box, or you could just put a dot or a slash or anything just so that there is some text in this box and you're not leaving it um, blank. But in this case, you need to type in your main point summary. And so I'm just putting that in there just as a space holder. Now, this is the real hack that I that I want to point out to those of you who are getting stuck at this point. It is right here. So um, how do you go? You're looking for um, the place where you will be you're able to to attach 
your file, right? But you're not seeing it here. And that is because what you need to do is to look at um, these buttons here below the message box. Um, the first two buttons are prominent or, you know, they're actual buttons in purple, but the other function um, is not highlighted or buttoned. And so it's kind of seems hidden and you wouldn't notice it, but that's what you need to notice that says advanced here, go ahead and click advanced. And when you do that, then the page is going to reload and take you to where uh, it's going to reload and uh, <clears throat> and bring up the, um, the upload box, the attachment box for you. So let's click on advanced. And when you scroll down below the message box, now you see the attachment box. And you go ahead and attach the file as per usual in, um, in a Moodle space. Okay, so then you choose the file from where you have it saved. In this case, I have it saved on my desktop. It's a PDF. Um, emancipation, where is it? There it is. Okay. And then um, you don't really have to put in the particulars here. I will delete that because I'm not the author. Upload this file, you select. And then so you, you can see that the file is uploaded here. Um, but of course you have to save that. So you scroll on to the, toward the bottom of this page and where you have the purple button that says post to forum, you click on post to forum and that should do the trick. And so you will see here that among the other um, forums that have already been posted, here is mine, this is me, and here is the, the, the title of the article that I have just um, attached, Emancipation Day in Trinidad and Tobago. And, just, and this is another advice to go ahead and click on it and to double check to make sure that it, that it did attach, right? So let's just double check before you log out. It's always a good idea. So there it is. You click on it and you see that it will download and your classmates or you or whomever uh, would like to read it is able to do so. Okay. So, so that's it. Those are the, um, the steps involved in, um, in attaching any file in a Moodle forum. I hope you have found this helpful. Um, if you still have questions about this, feel free to send me an email and, um, and we can have a one-on-one -on -one conference, um, a Google Meet meeting so that I can walk you through it. Okie dokie, bye.